Hi there, Jake Miller here, and today I want to talk to you about one of my favorite Chrome extensions for functionality, which is OneTab. Most people think of OneTab as just being a tool where you could take all of the sites that you have open at once and to quickly get them all closed so that you could free up a little bit of processing on your computer. You could kind of shrink them down into one tab as you see me do here. But I think there's a lot more to it than that. So first of all, you could rename the sets of tabs. So that then it's almost like a set of bookmarks. And then when you open them, they close out in there. So it's kind of like a to-do list. And then it's now no longer listed in our list of tabs, but it's open now for me to look at it. So I can go back, I can, I can kind of cross the things off as I make it to those websites. Or you can go to the options and lock all of the tabs in that group of tabs, and then they stay in this list on the one tab page, almost like a set of bookmarks. So now if I want to continue coming back to these conferences that I presented at before, I can keep it open and come back to here whenever I need to. Now notice you can also share this set of tabs. So if you've used it to organize a group of tabs that you want to share with somebody else, you could do that option click on it, it opens it up, and now you have this link that you can copy and send to somebody else, and then they could use it in just the same exact way you do. So it's a nice set of links that you could send to somebody. So if you're opening a group of pages and a coworker or colleague or somebody says, could you send those links to me, one tab will kind of do that for you, and copy it and send it right to them. Notice it even gives you the QR code there that you could use, which is cool. Notice there's also an import export button. So if you just want to copy the actual links rather than doing that share option, you could do it from here. Or if you have a set of links that you want to pull into one tab to organize in there, there's the import option there too. Now, if you have a separate set of links that you're opening up later, you could open them up or you could bring them into one tab separately. Notice that this time I do it using the extension button. So you could use either the extension button or the bring all tabs into one tab button on the one tab screen. And it creates a separate set of tabs, which I could then rename as a different group. Notice in here that among my favorite restaurants is one of the conferences that I've also presented at. So that goes in the other set of tabs. I can conveniently just drag it down there if I want to use one tab as an organizational tool. So as you can see, it really is much, much more than just a way to clear up the clutter of all the tabs that you have open. It's a really nice way to organize them, get them ready for you to come back and, and, and revisit them later or to um, create kind of a list of bookmarks that you could use.